Funky Science. I'm Professor TJ. And her sister Nelly Welly. And today we have an interesting experiment for you. But first, make sure you like this video. Thumbs up. <laughs> Click the thumbs up and subscribe to our channel. Woo! But first, let's just tell you something about this experiment. In this experiment, we will be making a volcano. Our lava might be homemade, but it will bubble out of our volcano. Let's have a go at making our own volcano with a twist. You can decorate your volcano so it looks realistic. Use paper mache and paint and crayons to make your volcano look like a real volcano. And this is what we would require. Liquid detergent, white vinegar, cup or glass, baking soda, spoon, and food color. And remember kids, always have an adult present as in doing this experiment. Safety first. All the time. Are you ready? Yes. Ready to start? Yes. Okay, so what we're going to do first, here are our cups. We're going to test how this volcano is going to look like cups. Things are going to blow up here. So, take some baking soda. Pour a, a teaspoon into each glass. Okay. Yeah, brought it closer. Okay, clever. Mm. Add here. Add another one here. Oh, yes, 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 that's good enough. Okay. Then take our food coloring. Yes. Yeah. Put some inside. Both. Yeah. We'll use the spoon. Okay. So that should mix it up. So take the food coloring and we'll just wipe it. Very something. Stir it. Now stir it. Mix it in. Mix it in. Mix it on this side now. Mix it, mix it. Is it looking difficult to do? No. And then make sure you don't anything else about baking so that it makes you sneeze. Perfect. Then I'm going to take some of our soap. Congratulations! You've just made your very own volcano using your very own chemical reaction. Mixing the acid, vinegar, and the alkali bicarbonate of soda and releasing bubbles of carbon dioxide. The liquid soap is just there to trap those bubbles so it flows over the volcano like real lava. I hope you at home are able to do this experiment. This is all we have for you today. See you next time on Funky Science. Bye.